it's adventure time again. I arranged to go to an island on the lake. The island is closed, so there's no other people apart from some staff. Hello, nice to meet you. And me, it's going to be two nights of solitary. Yeah, some kind of fancy English word. Right? One to go to Lupita Island. Uh, very secluded here on the lake. And only a couple villas up perched on the hill. And I'm super excited to go check it out. Villa, should I say, number seven, Livingston Suite. It's unbelievable. You have to see it to believe it. This completely open lodge style with like no walls around. An open bathroom, a bath up with views all over. Yeah, just incredible. I can't fathom that I am actually staying here by myself alone for like two nights and experience the whole island. Yeah, and even have my own little plunge pool. And villa number seven is called the Livingston Suite because it has all this area, but behind me is like a whole living room and actually also two separate beds for kids i guess it's like for a whole family to come and stay here it is a bit surreal and i admit it feels a bit crazy but i am the only one on lupita island people say oh you must get bored and i'm like no because apart from enjoying this absolutely gorgeous villa and the sun deck and my private little pool There is so much more here to do in Lupita Island. Yeah. With a gym like this, with such an epic view, I am definitely not missing an opportunity to work out. popular things to do here on Lake Tanganyika is to go scuba diving. There are heaps of beautiful colorful fish. Unfortunately, because of my ear problems, you know I can't dive anymore. But I am going to discover the beauty of this lake by kayak and snorkeling. Lake Tanganyika is considered the second deepest lake in the world. For some reason, Lake Tanganyika is also considered the second oldest lake in the world. Lupita Island is a great place to relax at the pool, in your villa, and then after a great day of all those activities, you can come here to the bar and you can get an ice cold beer. Thank you. 